I'm here with uh, with Coach Helfrich right now, the uh, the living pride of Coosbury. <laughs> I mean, come on, that, that, that's pretty pretty true. Might be the the just take away the living after a while, but um, yeah, we're here. Um, it's August first, right? And you're getting ready to go on Monday. Yeah, I guess we're gonna talk something. We liked um, kind of late '80s, early '90s hip hop. Is that true? <laughs> that is a fact. That's a fact. That's who, a fact. who did you kind of like though? Oh, he gosh. said NWA, which is very interesting. Yeah, which is probably appropriate. At this yeah. Point, yeah. <laughs> you weren't saying a lot, right? Right, right, yeah, yeah exactly. Uh, we liked it. Yeah, that was, uh, we had an influx of, of a little bit of everything. Yeah. West Coast, East Coast. Yeah. Anyway. yeah. Well, I mean, you guys didn't even have those, like, those, those East Coast, West Coast wars in high school, right? They didn't really <laughs> necessarily come up until, like, 94-ish or something. I, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. 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 So I knew that the cassette tape, you know, they had to put in, and yeah. flip over, and then fast forward. Yeah, no iPods or I don't know, CDs definitely. or anything like that. Yeah, that's my, that's my job. So it was, it was, it couldn't have been just NWA. I mean, maybe like in '92 when you were a senior, you might add. I don't know if you were a Tupac fan, but I think you were still kind of a. Yeah, I was not a big. That that kind of missed my little wheelhouse there um, for Tupac. I'm trying to, you know, Eric B. Rock him and who else was back then? Cool movie. Cool uh, movie. Curtis Blow. Curtis Blow. Uh, now yeah. that's that's bringing it back. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'd have to. Yeah. Now, did you ever just dress up in gold chains and start popping <laughs> and locking? You know, <laughs> nothing like that. Yeah, I bet you did. I bet you. Paul Rubenstein, your guy Paul Rubenstein, he had he had the nylon jacket backspin going. Yeah. 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 And he was doing that, that kind of stuff. So you never put down a cardboard box and just started. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You did. I was not. You were. Right? You were. We, we did backspin. Yeah. Yeah. You that, started. That was our. That was Kuzma dancing. Okay. Yeah. That was a. You guys like, had your own little uh, little set or whatever. Yeah. Like, exactly. People was. Well, that's that, that's cool. That's um, it's very interesting. Also. And this is the most incriminating thing, is that you guys like wore out the Milli Vanilli tape. <laughs> Milli Vanilli is huge. <laughs> yeah. The, like the, is, I mean, there was only one tape, right? Right, so yeah. Was a, uh, yeah. Milli Vanilli tape, exactly. Yeah. What? Who, what was who, Milli, was it? who was that that sang that? Milli Vanilli? Oh, I guess that's a really good question. Uh, uh, the, the, um, so why, why Milli Vanilli? Was it just why a line? Yeah, no, they were, they were huge back then. Yeah. yeah, I guess so. I, no, yeah. I think it was three at the time. So, um, <laughs> what? Floyd told me that you were into professional wrestling. <laughs> Is that true? Who was it in professional was wrestling? That, I, yeah, I Portland actually, wrestling back in the day. Portland yeah, wrestling? Portland so not, wrestling. not necessarily uh, Macho Man or anything like well, that? Well, no, Macho Man passed away, right? Yeah, yeah. he had a heart attack behind the wheel. You know, the, I think I was more, yeah, I was much more into Portland wrestling at the time, but you still had to be into What is Portland wrestling? Portland? Portland wrestling was like, you know, there was regional wrestling, like, uh, Playboy Buddy Rose and Billy mm -hmm. Jack Haynes, all about their start up there. So it's just they used to kind of travel throughout Oregon, and I think twice a week we're in Portland. Yeah. They used to come to, to uh, Marshall and you had to go there. Month or something. And your dad was, was working there, yeah. yeah your yeah. dad was a, was a, he was a, like, a amateur wrestler, not amateur, but Greco Roman, right? <laughs> right. Yeah. He wrestled, yeah, he wrestled in high school and college, right? Yeah. yeah. And so, I mean, that's kind of a weird transition. You know, I used to he play. wasn't a professional wrestler. No, no. He, he wouldn't look good in the outfits. Right? Yeah, kind of. Uh, what is the What is the lasting thing that you're gonna You're gonna remember from Cruz Bay and where you're gonna like? Is there any kind of thing that you're gonna really kind of carry out to last while you're here? I think just what we're talking about, just the, the people. You know, I think anytime you're around people that, that that are just solid to the core, hardworking, uh, fun. You know, it's just. A, it, Every memory that I have of Coos Bay is great and positive and, and uh, Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. But it was, it was yeah. awesome to each other. Great to meet you too, yeah. And I yeah. wish you, uh, well, I'm also going to be rooting for you the best of luck. But uh, yeah, I wish you the best of luck this awesome. year.